Good morning everybody and welcome to the Halcinia farm. You can see behind us we have the DFS system which is created by Ice Dover. So we've got fields, we've got trees, we've got a well and cheese maker and all the other stuff. So I, I do like this. It's good quality, good fun and good interaction and Ice Dover does listen to his community. So you can see what we're looking at here is we're looking at some um, crops I grow, tomatoes, hay, corn, wheat, um, a few fruit trees in the background, a few of the little, little bits and pieces and bits and bobs over here. I don't use a windmill, I use a reza for any extra barrels, saves me a little few things there. And these resers will res anything that is DFS. Right, so you can see that we've got our herd over here. We've got our cows, we've got our pigs, we've got our sheep. We've got the reser for the hay. We've got our reser for the pig food. Deep there, I'll sit down a little bit. Got got the feed mill, which is very very important. What you do need to have for the new hay bales. If you've got old hay bales, they will still work. Right. So what you can see is Iceover kindly gave us some. Hay piles over here. This is the new recipe. It went live on the 29th of the 9th of 2018. See, they're simple, they're easy, they're quick to make. Okay, each one takes about a minute. So we've got four hay piles. So I'm going to res one out in a minute. There we go. You can see that the quality of uh, the DFS farming system is top notch. I don't know what else to say about it. It's it's really good. It makes you feel like you do have a farm. You can see that the land impact here is very important. It's only one. You can have a few of these out in your fields. Just a little bit of um, RP going there if that's the sort of thing that you like to do. Wow. Right, so this is what you need. Like I say, you need to feed milk. We're going to have a look at the recipe again, and we're going to say, right, okay, we're going to make the 100 bale. And you can see that what we're going to be doing first is number eight. Okay, you need to click number eight on your craft. Then you click on the hay pile. You click use. That goes into your DFS crafting HUD. Close the recipe. Okay, you double click on the feed mill. And you can see it takes around about 60 seconds, i.e. one minute. Now, it's been a while since I've done these, so I do apologize about the sound quality. This is why I'm recording it. But I would like to say that if you're looking for a farming system, DFS is it. It's got all the role play, it's got all the little goodies, you can have a big farm, you can have a small farm, you can do pigs, sheep, you can make furniture, I believe, you can make a brewery, so you can make beer. I don't think we can make wine yet, I'm not sure on that. So we're coming up to around about 10 seconds left. We're going to see the bale. 
And don't worry, if you've got other bales, the old bales, they still work. Okay? They still work. So don't worry about having to change them or, or they're not working. They'll still feed the cows. You'll just, as of the release of this video, you'll start getting hay piles instead of hay bales. Right, so we're just waiting for it to be delivered. It can, you know, take a little bit of a few seconds. There we go. Right, so we just drag and drop that out. So you can see, there we are. Hay bale is what you normally have, but the new hay bale has 100 next to it, okay? It has 100 next to it in bracket. The old hay bales didn't. So what we're going to be looking at now is... 300 hay bales so you need to drag out all three of your hay piles again you can get this recipe off the off the website i put mine on note cards so i don't have to keep opening and searching for them on the website so we're now going to be clicking number seven click the hay bale click the use button then we're going to be clicking number eight. Click use. Click number nine. Click the click the pile. Click use. Hit the menu. Again, you can see it's only going to take a minute. I'm going to double click on that. And there we go, 60 seconds, i.e. one minute, and you've got a hay bale that is 300, and we're going to rest that out. And like I said, quality of DFS is good. All I'm going to say is that every single week, there's something new coming out. It could be a new recipe. It can be a new product. It can be... Um, new stuff that only comes out for christmas or halloween you know so go go to the sim be in the community and be a part of it right so we've got around about 15 seconds left to go um and i do do a lot of promotion dfs farm i've made videos in the past and i've making videos again I used to live stream that I might start live streaming it again and um, like I said something to do in second and it's in we're just gonna wait until we've got the the bale this is a new bale I've never seen it before this is the first time I've done it Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I am a vampire. So a lichen. Come on. Give us that bale. We want our bale for our cows. And our sheep. Sheep also use hay. Here we go. Here's the new 300. So if it accepts it, we're going to res it out. And there we go. Look, it's a round bale. And again, if you notice, it will say 300. Okay, and you can see, it looks like a proper proper round hay bale. This is what you'd find on your local farm. You know, it looks like it's been wrapped in um, you know, some kind of plastic cloth. So if we look at the edit, again, you can see the landing pad is one. Like I said, this is extremely very important. And this is what Oystover understands. Good quality products, low ran land impact. So we're going to close the crafting system now because we don't need, we don't need it. There's a the recipe again. Don't forget you can get this on the website. It went live on the 29th of the 9th of 2018.
Now what we're going to do is we're going to show you that these can be used in the DFS Reza. Okay, so we're going to take all the other bales out. And we're going to put in the 300 bale. Right, these are the old bales that I've got in there. They're perfectly going to be used. There we put in the new, new 100 one. Okay, I'm going to take all the old ones out now. Drag and drop those over to my inventory there. Yes, there. I'm going to take it out. Okay. Alright, we're going to take the top one off. And. There we go. It's rest. So if you've got your DFS resins, which I believe come um, come free, I never bought mine. I can't remember if I was giving them or if they came free. I think they do come free, and um, that's it. You don't have to use up a lot of prims. The resin is one prim. Shove your hay bales in there, and what I found is it gives a better even quality of food to my animals and if I just stack them all out um, at once so my advice is when you make these 300 bales use a reza again this is something that the um, DFS take pride in they they remember that not everybody has a big stem see that my farm is only a small one I only do very very small amount 